the first thing. Yes. So, windshield wiper assembly's got to come off? Here. All of this. And that. It's all got to come off. Because the actual spark plugs. I remember. Are right there, but you can't get the coils out. It's not enough. Oh, okay. And before I start, Mark Sita. Mark the. No, Mark the windshield wipers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, it's just twelve. Seems to me. Oh, there is one. Yeah, I was going to say, there's another one in there somewhere. It's a real pain in the butt. It's actually a... Looks like it's, you have to... It's a push-in. Yeah, push-in rubber grommet thing. Oh, yeah, it, sli it looks like it slides to the left. Ah! Yeah. Oh, good call, good call. Almost out of there. Yeah. You need to pull on those. it? I'll try pulling that one first. Just give it a second. There we go. Now I'll try. Yeah. Key break. Is this what you used to pull this this thing off? No, actually, I just used oh. I used this thing. And what I did was this. Right there. Uh huh. You push in. Like oh, okay. That, and that releases them, and you have to pick it up while you're doing it. So these things have to be folded back, is that what they... You have to fold them down to get the tray oh, out because okay. it's too tall. But thank God when you first pull on it, it grabs this one at just the right angle and pops that off. And then you can see that that one's caught up in the corner. And there's the engine. 
now we can access the plugs and the coils. Yep. So that one's bad. So I'm gonna change that one. So out. how do you know that one's bad? You put it on a. I checked on a scanner. Okay. And it said uh, okay. misfire cylinder three and multiple misfire three times on a multiple misfire. Oh, okay. Pending, current, and history on the coil number three. So it's done. <coughs> Now, I don't know if you knew about this, but any of these connections, yeah. don't ever physically touch them. Okay. Ever. I don't care what you use. You could use an insulated fucking oh, screwdriver oh. or something. If you touch them, it'll go right through the insulation. Because it's like six or seven hundred amps DC. Oh, wow. Uh-huh. And it's like literally, you touch it, you're dead. If not, you might be. You are. Yeah, this is a lot easier than the first generation. The first generation, they had another tray on top of that metal one. Oh. Well, I think it was a... Uh, uh, original thought was it was a primary uh, crap catcher. There's the ABS unit. Fucking buried. Oh, scary. Yeah. Yeah, she Is it push in or pull out? Oh, okay, I see, yeah. Fuck Almost have to grab it with a... This is what I did last time. I think uh -huh. I just disconnected these oh. and just popped it uh -huh. all off. So you just do that. And you got all the spark plugs right down in there. Hmm. And now's the great time to change the valve cover gasket if it needs it. Mm -hmm. I believe on these, they just glued it down. There's a gasket in there, but they glued it on. They glued it both sides? Yeah. Wow. Well, one side. You can see a little bit of that goo sticking out right there. All right. So this is the one that's got to go. Can you test that out of the uh, system or what? As far as I know, all the tests I've ever had to do on those, they're, they're inconclusive. Okay. <coughs> Once in a while, you'll test one and it'll be like an open circuit or something. You know, you do, all right. you do a ground to here. Okay. And then check it and it's like, yeah. Oh, look at this part. And you have to pray that the nipple on the top is actually steel. Yeah, it is. Oh, too bad. Let's see what a new one looks like. <laughs> well, that's what they used. These are these are iridiums. Yeah, Denzo. Iridium now. The good stuff, man. And they go in there pretty far, like... Yeah. An and inch and what, quarter? The reason it was hard to get out is from probably about right there on. Uh-huh. It's sticking in the cylinder. So it gets debris on it. Oh. There's a new one. Yeah, they're pretty fucking close. Oh, yeah. It ate away at this bar. Okay. See how it's gouged up? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I noticed that. Well, hopefully that will solve the problem. Yeah. With that coil, right? Yeah, and the coil. But it, it kept saying multiple misfire even though the coil issue was there. So multiple misfire, that, that means that the other coils were misfiring? That means the other spark plug. Oh, oh the other spark plugs. Sometimes the only code it'll kick is multiple misfire. Like you could have a bad coil. And of course if you have the the fancy manual shit, 
it tells you all the specs you can check the wires on each coil and make sure the process to use anything but the original part original parts huh? or, or higher quality but you never go with the inexpensive ones ever even though it may just work perfect huh it's interesting on a sequoia the same size and everything oh yeah yeah it's a different numbers five four 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 and this is a five four 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 they are the same number So that's different than regular uh... anti-seize. Yeah, regular anti-seize is aluminum. Regular anti-seize will work. Because aluminum is pretty good ground, but I like the copper shit. Cause it seems like maybe the, the molecules are a little bit bigger, so it's smoother when you tighten the threads down. It'll be like... Arr, 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 arr. <laughs> Makes a huge difference to so the next guy is going to be like, wow, man, that last guy did it right. But there's a way to get beyond that. Is so, take one of these off. Does that have a rubber cap oh, on Oh, careful. That's uh, grease. Oh, that's stinky ass shit, man. That's uh, fluid film, baby. Guaranteed never to rust. But yeah, that's just a, oh, it's film. Just a seal right there. All right. Yeah, I didn't think I'd be able to get it off. You have to break them to get them off. So, we have to wedge, and the trick is going like this, that side, and, yep, yeah, there we go, okay, distort the shield, ah, ow, ah. And pads. Alright, and then you should be able to just go like that. There, there, see? Now, see if you got it right. These will get down. There's one. Like that, Dad. Hot damn, come on. And then you got two of these little push fuckers. Kind of like these. I wish they were all like this but they tend to break. Oh, so you can yeah. see that one's got a wing broken off right there. Uh, push but pin. But once they're in, you just push the pin perfectly level, uh, and then uh -huh. to take it out, you just push it down, which is really simple. I mean, this shit, having to pry it up on some fucking more last 20, 30 year old plastic, it's like, it don't work, man. Voila. Somebody is almost Oh, there's two posts for one uh, wiper. Yeah. And one of them's just a pivot point. Oh. Let's see, how's that mark? It's looking? lining up almost perfect, yeah. It's good enough for me. Stay. Don't move. Oh, this was a lot less labor than that first one I did. What year, this what year must was? be the second generation oh, or something. Uh -huh. I think it was like in 2002. Uh -huh. Oh, one low. Okay. Yeah, looks like it might 
Might have shot it one notch low. Mm, no, that's all right. <coughs> we are almost finished with the procedure. Right there. Find out shortly. Shortly. Yep, that's pretty good. I'll wait to put that on until I give the wipers a test. Sounds pretty good. Huh? Sounds pretty good. Yeah, it's not too bad. It sounded fine before. Oh, did it? Just, yeah, it would randomly do it. You know, just oh. like driving around. Sometimes when it was cold, it would do it. Sometimes when it was hot, it would do it. I'm like, oh, oh. let's check the codes and see what the fuck they say. And they said misfire. So I'm like, okay, spark bikes. And this is a little tricky because you have to get that back one on first. Clear the codes. Oh, coolant is slow. <clears throat> That's not good. That is, whoa. That is not good. Uh -uh. Well, at least you know the cap works. <laughs> Alright, that's that weird pinky shit. Fucking $35. No. Pink stuff. Fancy. 